what is going on guys today we have a really cool video hopefully and it's gonna be 44 websites and apps for resellers guys uh thanks so much for coming i know this is unscheduled live uh, we have a lot of cool interviews scheduled i gotta get those events up in youtube let me know if you guys can hear me uh let me know if everything's good we'll get into this um it is truly 40 well it's gonna be about 42 to 44 websites and apps I'm gonna kind of go through each and every one with you and uh, kind of explain what they do. We'll try to be as quick as possible because it's quite a bit to go through. And this is gonna be everything from discount codes, manufacturer codes, to like um, pretty much everything reselling related. This video is gonna kind of have all the sites I use and all the sites that, uh, that, that others use too. So that's weird, no alert. All right, so let's give it a few more minutes for people to pop in. I will be sharing my screen um, to show you guys. We'll pull it up in real time. We'll pull up all the websites. I wasn't gonna do this video for a while, but I figured since it's going into fourth quarter here, um, possibly you guys may utilize some of these sites. What's going on, Hugo? What's going on, Lou? What's going on? Ja, what's going on? Russell Raccoon, welcome in. Um, I know this was an unscheduled video. It's really weird you guys didn't get a um, notification. YouTube, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. What's going on, best friend? Welcome in. Okay, so I'm going to try to be quick. This is going to be about a 45-minute video. Um, and uh, we'll go ahead and do this. Training the clients that need to watch this late. You need to train me, my man. What's going on, Beth? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Hopefully, you're out there listing and crushing it, Beth. Okay, so let's get into this, guys. I know a lot of people are going to jump in late. Uh, like I said, this is an unscheduled video about 44 websites and apps that you can use. I don't know if you guys know all these or possibly some of these. Maybe some of these can help you. Um, this is a big collection of them. So, all right, so let's do this. I'm going to go ahead and share my screen and then we'll get started. Okay, guys? Let's see here. And I've got chat pulled up on my laptop, so I'll be able to see chat if you guys have questions. And while we're doing this, you guys know um, if you have any websites or apps that you use that you like using that is not in this list, let me know. The purpose of this is to have a library, a library of really cool websites and apps that you can use. So um, if you guys have something I don't have, I'll add it. And uh, hopefully it benef benefits other resellers here. So let's see. Let me go ahead and share my screen. And we will share the desktop. All right. Let me know if you guys can see my desktop here. And I've got my, um, I've got my, okay, perfect. I can still see chats. Okay. So I'm going to try to be as quick as possible, guys, because there's a lot of them to go through here. Um, I, full transparency, I'm going to tell you which ones are affiliates and which ones are not. So meaning, which ones I get a, a portion of the sale, which ones I don't. I can tell you that out of all these, about 85% of them I do not get paid. I'm not affiliated. So 85% of these I don't get anything for. I solely put this so it's kind of like a library for resellers to have everything in one spot. Okay. Um, so that being said, I will let you know which ones are affiliate, but the majority of them are not I do not get paid on the majority of them. Uh, but if you do want to support me and you do use these links, I do appreciate it. I just want to make sure that we're full, full transparency here. So we're going to start at the top. Most of these are going to be affiliates, and then we'll work our way to the bottom. There's a lot of cool websites that I'm sure a good portion of you guys possibly may not know of, and then a good portion of them you probably do. So we'll get started here. Um, and I'm going to start with the obvious ones first, okay? And we'll work our way down. Um, there's no particular order. In fact, some of the ones that are at the very end are probably the better ones. So let me go and get started. So you know my YouTube channel, that's not included in the 44. Um, this one is. So guys, and just so you know, you can go through my uh, Instagram link to get all these links in these websites if you need to, okay? Um, anyway, so the first one basically is going to be my reseller supplies. There's 103 items. Yes, I have bought every single item on this list. Yes, I would not promote something that I didn't think was a good product. Um, so if you need reseller supplies, these are this is an affiliate program. Um, 
It doesn't cost you anything extra, but if you want to support me, this is the first link. And it has everything that I have bought. In fact, you see the chair that is right here. That's the chair that I'm sitting in right now. Uh, it has all the poly bags I use, all the displays I use. I put a couple options, one more affordable, one not. That's the steamer I use. Just everything on this link, guys, pretty self-explanatory. So if you need the backdrop, the printer, everything. So if you need reseller supplies, that is the first link. And um, we'll go to the next one here. All right, so that was the first one. We're not going to do my Poshmark. Um, that is uh, obviously, uh, you guys can go check it out if you want, but that's uh, that's another one. Okay, so we're getting down We're getting down to the better stuff as we go down. We'll go to Robinhood next. Now, you're probably asking, why is Robinhood up here? Yes, um, this is an affiliate Robinhood. Uh, but in these links, I want to incorporate like making money. That's the purpose of this. So if everybody that's watching this that does not have Robinhood, I'm sure you've heard about it from other resellers, like go download it. It takes two seconds. And I'll tell you exactly what you need to do, okay? So you download this, whether you use my link or you use somebody else's link, you need to use a link. Because if you download this thing and set it up without using somebody's link, you will not get a free stock. And it is completely free. There's no hiccups. There's no strings attached. Literally, you will get a, a share of a company tonight by downloading this app. So use somebody's link. I don't know um, if you want to use another reseller and support them. If you use my link, it gives me a free share and it gives you a free share. And um, I do a lot of stocks. This is the best website to do it. It's it's like E-Trade. It's a broker. And so uh, you can get a free share. And then once you get your free share, then you will get your own unique link that you can give to your family, and then you can get a share off of them when they sign up, all right? Uh, so this is a really important thing only because it gives you a free share of a company and you have a chance to get in uh, kind of a nice company. So that's the, that's the second one. Let's go ahead and go on to the third one here. All right, so this is another investing website that I recommend, Acorns. It's, it, it is really, really unique. Now, us resellers, we're on a budget. We don't have a lot of money sometimes. Our capital is tight. It's all about cash flow. This is literally, guys, and I would not I would not recommend this if it wasn't a good one. So you download this, and what it does is you can link your debit or credit card. So every time you buy something, it will round it up. So if you buy something for $0.79, cents, it will round it up to a dollar, and it will take that difference and put it in your account. And then you can start investing basically that way. So it's a, it's a slow way to invest, but those pennies and quarters add up. So no longer will you basically, it's kind of like change. You won't have change. It will add it up to the next dollar. And then whatever that is, even if it's a penny, it will add it to your amount here. So it's a slow way to build up without putting a ton of capital down. Okay. This is an affiliate link for me. I don't know. I, I don't even think anybody signed up yet. Cause I'm just um, putting it out there, but, um, I would recommend two things. One, you guys do the, the um, Robin Hood ASAP because you get a free stock of a company. And then two, download this so you can start saving those pennies and, and quarters and dimes and kind of add it up slowly. Soon you'll have a couple grand in there, guys. And, and there's no strings attached here. You can withdraw your money anytime. So, And there's more that that website does. You guys can go read about it. All right, so now we're getting into the, the good stuff here. We'll go to the fourth website. This one is called TubeBuddy, guys. Um, this is a website that I use for YouTube, okay? This does a lot of things. So the thumbnails, which is basically the um, the pictures of all my YouTube videos, this is what I use, TubeBuddy, okay? Now, this is an affiliate. They give me 10 bucks, I believe, when somebody signs up. But actually, I don't recommend you pay. Um, I recommend you do the free one, <clears throat> which they don't give me anything for that, which is fine. So download TubeBuddy if you're interested in um, starting a YouTube channel or you already have a YouTube channel. One of the last things it does too, guys, you know when you go to you um, when you go to um, uh, different videos in YouTube and you cannot see what their keywords are. Once you download this thing, you'll be able to see exactly what everybody uses for their keywords, and it will help you kind of divide yourself from the competition to get your videos up. But it's free; it doesn't cost anything. So download the free version and get that website going if you have a YouTube channel. All right, so this is another website that I recommend. It's called um, um, Imperfect Produce, basically, guys. 
they don't go to all locations, but this is cheaper than going to your grocery store to get fruits and vegetables. Okay, now you're asking why am I doing this? It's not reselling related. The bottom line is you can save a lot of money by doing this. And what it is is it's just weird looking fruits and vegetables. They will um, they get highly discounted, and so you can pick what you want. Um, you can customize your box basically. And um, you can do vegetables, fruits, or both. And then they will send it to you. And it's super cheap. I think it's like uh, your first box is like $16. And they send you a huge box, guys. So it's way cheaper than going to a um, grocery store. Um, and, you know, you can kind of customize it too. And, and they actually ship it to your house. So they deliver it to you in these little boxes here, okay? So it's all about saving money. Don't skip on this stuff. Like this is going to save you money by doing it. So, and again, if you need to get to any of this stuff, you can just go to my Instagram and click my link tree and it's all there. But um, that being said, this is the site that I use. You can pick weekly, bi-weekly or monthly, I believe. And it's extremely cheap once you look at the cost of it. So, okay. So now we're getting into a lot of the other stuff here. Let's go ahead and go to Ebates here. You guys all know about this site, right? Um, I can see chat. Does, does any of you guys not know about this site, Ebates, and kind of how it works? Where you get cash back, basically, if you shop at some of these locations. Remember, guys, when you're doing out there and you're sourcing and you're trying to make, um, you know, you're trying to buy product to sell, you need as many discounts, coupon codes, manufacturer codes as you can get, right? So this is a site that will help you with that um, cash back and um, percent offs and stuff. So check this out. And, and, I don't know if this is affiliate or not. I can't remember. Um, I honestly don't know. So, but I'll put it out there and just say it is, but I don't think I've never really promoted this. So I'm not even too sure. Actually, I don't even know if I know my, um, I don't know if it has an affiliate link or not, but anyways, this is a site that I highly recommend. If you guys have not checked it out, it'll give you. So when you shop at these different locations, you can get up to a certain amount off cash back basically. Right. So, all right, let's go to the next tier. All right, this is a site that I love using, guys. This is going to help you. This is crazy. I don't know why more people don't do this site. So what it is basically is this. It's very, very simple. If you guys remember on my Instagram about four months ago, you guys remember how I had like 40 checks? I had like 40 checks from this company. Um, and what, the, 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 what it does, it's very simple. So you download the app. It doesn't cost you anything. It's completely free. Okay. So you download the app and when you purchase stuff on Amazon from these different uh, places, like um, any, a lot of places online, like Amazon, or um, if you purchase stuff through like um, any, any, I'm trying to think of any other websites. Like um, I don't know if I believe it even works with eBay and other different websites, um, not eBay in the um, sense that you're buying a product, like a used product from somebody, but if you're buying brand new products, um, you can basically download this app and what it will do basically is, is it will scan it, right? Um, so it will scan it constantly for 30 days, I believe. And then see, these are some of the other stores that it works with too. It actually doesn't work with eBay. I apologize. It works with Walmart, Sears, um, Amazon is the big one. That's where I got all my checks from. And, uh, so what it is, is you download this and if the price drops on the item, these guys will send you a check automatically. And all you have to do is link up your debit or credit card to it. Um, so link up the debit or credit card that you use to make your purchases. And I'm assuming a lot of you guys use like Chase and different things for points. And once the price goes down, these guys will notify you. They will scan it and they will give you the difference basically. So it's one of those things where some of these credit cards the one of the rules is is if the, like for example chase what i use if the price goes down on chase they have to give you the difference within 30 days and so these guys will take a very small cut but then they'll send you a check for the rest so it's basically free money and it's all automatic they they do everything for you so literally you download the app you buy stuff if the price drops on amazon then they'll send you the difference um this is an um this is an affiliate i get i think a dollar when people sign up for this when they actually use it but Again, I've never even looked into, uh, even if I have anything there. So full disclosure, but that thing is amazing. doesn't cost you any money. All right, so we're going to the next. 
Do you guys know about this website by chance? You may not, honey, by chance. It's a really cool website. Oh, man. It's a, so, so basically, I'm wondering if it's, um, oh, I don't have it downloaded here. So it's very, very simple. Okay. This is a cool sourcing website. Uh, you can see I don't use it much uh, on, on my business one, but I have a personal account that I use it on a lot on because uh, I used it before I started doing social media. So this site is basically one of those things where you download it and it's an extension, extension on your web browser, guys. So um, it's just like it adds to your web browser. And then when you search for different things, let's say you want to search for like a video game or let's say you're searching for this book here. It will tell you which website has it cheapest, okay? So it will tell you which website has the book cheapest so you can go and you can purchase it. So it's an extension that lets you know, hey, it's cheaper on Amazon than it than it is going to the Sears.com. So it lets you know, hey, are you buying something and if you're overspending or not. So you download it to your extension and if you search for an item on the on any if you you don't have to go through this website to search it, but uh, I mean, you basically search for a product. If it's cheaper somewhere else, it will let you know and you can purchase it. So this is a free thing, again, that you can use to save you time and money by, you know, sourcing for, for cheaper items. All right. Let's go on to the next one. If I'm going too fast, guys, let me know. I'm trying to get to all these. So GoDaddy, here's another one, guys. Now, a lot of people use QuickBooks, okay? I prefer GoDaddy because it automatically syncs everything for me and it gives me a graph on where i'm spending my money okay one of the problems i believe with uh outlook or excuse me not outlook uh quickbooks is um i i believe you have to manually put stuff in i don't use it personally but i believe you have to manually put it in this automatically downloads everything the only thing it doesn't work for unless they fixed it and i don't believe they'd have because i haven't sold too much on poshmark is I don't believe it works on Poshmark. Maybe they fixed it, but for everything else, it does. So um, I like GoDaddy. I like it personally for my finances, for taxes and different things like that. It's pretty affordable, and um, it will. Uh, this is this link that I have here will will kind of send you right there where you need to go to get the the accounting software for it. But it automatically downloads all, so you upload all your bank accounts, all your credit cards, all your debit cards, all your store cards. And when you make those purchases, it'll automatically take that, put it up here, easy for you to read, either on the desktop or your, um, your app on your phone, okay? So, yeah, that's a good, that's a good tip, West. Um, all right, so this one I got to give up to exclusive. You guys remember that interview that we had? Um, <clears throat> this is a really cool. This a lot of people asked me about this, and I was super, uh, super uh, pleased when she brought it up. Her and her amazing husband. So, you guys know that uh, it's a pain in the butt when you get receipts, right? So this is a basically a cool site that I added. Um, so you can upload all your receipts, and they'll upload it for you. They also do more stuff than just this but you can download this app it doesn't cost anything and so when you have a receipt let's say you go to ross dress for less and you have a receipt for four or five items you scan it up here and it will automatically download to the app and this is uh, from what i understand this app is free uh, they do offer bookkeeping services but for this it's completely free so exclusive and her husband brought this up to me and uh, i had to add it to the list so you can see how you can upload it and, and you can even approve or not approve it too, which is cool. So again, this is something that I think a lot of people don't do and they should. Easy for bookkeeping, right? So if you have 50 receipts, just all you do is you take a picture with your phone and it will upload right to the app. I mean, how easy is that, right? No more having like scan, you know, those old scanners that cost like 80 bucks where you have to scan in and then it sends it to your desktop or your computer. No more do you have to do that. You just use this app and you're up and running. Resell, I think this is huge for resellers right here. So, all right. Let me know if I'm going too fast, guys. And and again, I apologize if you know about a lot of these sites, but hopefully these can help you. So sign up for free on this one. All right, let me take a drink of water here. It's actually coffee. 
All right, let's go on to the next, okay? All right. <clears throat> okay, so this is a, uh, okay. I'm not logged in here, but so guys, if you're, um, if you're looking to starting YouTubes, if you're looking to like up your game on Instagram and you want to be professional and kind of have different professional photos, um, or if you need a YouTube banner, or if you need anything done, like for example, if you want, um, some different things done in your Insta stories or something that looks cool. This is a really affordable site that I use to, uh, to basically, I, I used to use it. I actually have somebody that does all my, uh, graphic design work now, <clears throat> but if you need graphic design work, this is the site that you need. And, uh, it's very, very simple. You can buy some of these, you can get people to design stuff for you for like four, um, five, six, seven bucks, 10 bucks. It's really affordable. Um, and by the way, the last app that I used, um, to answer your question was the wave app, wave receipts. And, um, that's the wave app guys. And remember, if you need it, if you need any of these links, you can go to my Instagram and, um, I have all these links there for you. Um, so this is a cool app. Uh, this is a cool website guys. This you can use if you need graphic design for your YouTube channels or your Instagram, I highly recommend it. You got really great artists on here and they'll send you the, the, uh, they'll send you the designs and you upload it and it's super, super cheap, super cheap. Okay. Let's move on to the next. All right. So we're going to move on to some sourcing websites real quick. Blue lots. You guys all know about this. I'm not going to spend too much time on it, but <clears throat> blue lots is a um, liquidation site guys. Um, liquidation Ohio is a really good uh, YouTube channel to follow. If you're into liquidations, like, you know, uh, returns from stores, returns from Amazon returns in general. Um, this is on the higher end. It does, uh, um, it is on the higher end of the liquidation sites that I have. So it does cost more. Look at this. Um, <clears throat> it does cost more on this site than normal sites here. Um, uh, but if you're looking for liquidation, you want it shipped to your house. So you can just list it for fourth quarter to kind of save you time. Blue lots is a really good site to use. They're reliable. I've used them once. I know um, one of the managers there reached out to me. Um, they were gonna. I was gonna do an unboxing on the YouTube channel, but I decided not to because I don't want to come across as selling people things. But um, regardless, they're a really good site to use. But they are on the more expensive site, guys. So if you're looking for um, inventory to go to your house, and and the cool thing too is you can kind of see what items they are, so you can look up the cost before you bid and buy. So, all right, let's go on to the next one. Liquidation.com, similar. This is a cool site to use. Um, I've only used it um, once, and this was a long time ago. Um, not as expensive as Blue Lots. And again, Liquidation Ohio will know more about this website. But Liquidation.com is another option you can kind of scan through here. And what I recommend, guys, is don't spend your whole day scanning these products. Do it when you're in bed, right? Bring your laptop, do it when you're in bed. So you're not wasting your day away, like doing research, do research when you kind of have downtime, you know, when your wife is watching TV and she gets to pick the TV show and then you have to sit there and work. So, uh, do it, do it on your downtime though. But yeah, this is another good website to use liquidation.com. All right. <clears throat> no rhyme or reason. Remember this could be for new resellers, this video for new resellers too. USPS.com. <clears throat> Gives you free supplies, guys. If you need supplies, do it as soon as possible. Holiday season's right here. And you can see it's zero cost, guys. It, you don't need a business account for it. Um, you don't need a business account for it. Uh, well, you, you sign up for a business account. But you, what I mean by that is you don't need a tax ID or anything. You can just sign up for a, an account. They'll ship you all these supplies. You can see that you get all kinds of different sizes. Board games. You know, you get... Um, Regional A, Regional B, these are really good. Um, I never get the uh, Express, just the priority. Um, it's really rare that somebody needs that. Here's a shoebox one. I use these constantly, guys. So what you do, USPS.com, set up your account. You can go through here. Let's say you want the shoebox. You can do packs of 25. You got a maximum of 20, but just do a couple or you know whatever you want. But that's quite a few. And then literally the cost will be zero when you check out 
they'll send it to you and then you can start shipping out stuff. So that kind of saves you time. I remember when I first started, I was going to the USPS.com or excuse me, I would go to the, the brick and mortar USPS um, and, you know, pick up their stuff. And then I realized you can do it online. So, all right. So let's go on to the next less obvious here. Okay. So I get this question a lot guys. <clears throat> oh, I had to sign into my eBay store. So anyways, this is the link right here ebay um, shipping coupon link <clears throat> if you have an ebay store i have an anchor store and uh, when you have an anchor store i get 150 dollars per quarter but you also it, even if you have one of the other tier stores you get basically a voucher a coupon every quarter that you can use to purchase supplies so when you guys see the videos i have on instagram um, the supplies that i have is from this and every quarter you can go ahead and get free supplies. So it's just another way to save money. Remember, this game is all about the pennies. I mean, you do, you want to save as much as you can in different areas so that way you can spend it on merchandise and different things. So, all right, so if you need free supplies and you have an eBay store, click that. They'll give you a coupon, link, uh, like a, a code. So you can pick out what you want, use that code, and it will literally take that off your purchase. Um, so I don't spend any money on supplies. Tape is really important. Okay, let's go on to the next. I don't use this anymore. <clears throat> um, this is just, I put a link to the different stores, guys. So if you're if you're wondering, hey, I would like to figure out what the cost is for these different stores, um, the links are right here. So eBay store fee calculator will tell you exactly what this costs to have eBay stores right here, okay? Um, so I'm the anchor store right here. And by the way, these prices down below, I believe, are annual. Or, you know, that's like you have to sign up for a year, basically. This normally would be $79.95, I believe, if you just do month to month. But, yeah, these are the prices right here, guys. If you're interested in getting an eBay store, you can see what the prices are here. And it's just a quick um, eBay store fee calculator right here. So, okay. All right. Let's, let's go on to the next here. All right. So let's go on to the next estate sales. I don't know if exclusive is still in chat, <laughs> but if you want to find estate sales, this is the web. This is one of the websites to use, estatesales.net. It's in the link tree there, um, and it will give you pictures. Guys, go follow her YouTube channel if you want to go check this out. She's got some examples in there, but um, you can basically um, kind of scope out a lot of the stuff that's in the estate sales. To find out if it kind of if, is if it's worth going, and possibly look up comps on different things before you even go. So estatesales.net is another good one, guys. If you want to go to estate sales, you know, and estate sales are basically in people's houses and different things, and you can go and, and uh, source, which is a great opportunity. I think it's underutilized. So, all right. So auction zip, guys. This is a really cool website. Um, I use it a lot. Um, give me one second here. So this is where you can find auctions in your area. This is one of the ways guys. So you can kind of search by your state, <clears throat> which, um, you know, depending on where you live, you just search by your state and, um, and you can basically go ahead and find where the auctions are in your area. So let's go ahead and click California. Um, so you can see time date exactly where the locations are for the auctions. So if you want to source and pick up merchandise in different er uh, in your you know immediate area, um, and you want to pick up like a lot of merchandise, or you want to go to an auction possibly that has like one offs. Here's a storage unit auction right here. Um, so you can click that, and you can go to the you know and kind of see a little bit of details. Four storage units means four of these are going up for auction. So auctionzip.com is a really good website if you want to source that way. Now, I've heard a lot of bad things about this site recently, GovDeals. I've used it three times. This is another site that you can use. Now, GovDeals is a site that basically has all the government, nonprofits, um, liquidation companies. They'll use this um, when it comes to the government. And, um, you know, a lot of universities, public schools will use this. And you can go through this site, GovDeals. I haven't had any problems, but recently I've heard people that have had problems but <clears throat> there's a lot of stuff here that they sell that's kind of unique. And so you can go through this site and uh, find different different products. You can kind of search for what you want. Like, um, so we'll search for clothes and you can get clothing lots. See, you got this clothing lot here. 
that you can pick up and don't let it fool you some of these places do ship so if you find something in california and you want it shipped to you you can if do you guys remember when i purchased those um nike hats I, I can't remember exactly how many it was. I think there was 40 Nike, vintage Nike hats. It was from Gov Deals. So this is a good site to use, guys. Um, I haven't, ha haven't had any problems with it, but um, just another way. Okay. All right, so let's go on to the next tier. So this is a website that I haven't shown anybody yet. It's called Bid13. Um, it's almost as good as Storage Treasures. And this is a site that you can buy, um, basically find and bid on storage lockers in your area guys so if you're into if you want to pick up a lot of merchandise even if you're not into storage lockers it's good to at least look at this periodically because they may a lot of businesses use storage lockers and then they go out of business and then you can pick up a lot of inventory so it's not just individuals that lose it's it's businesses too so businesses um well well you know basically go out of business and then you can go check so check this site periodically it's really simple to use. You just type in your proximity, your zip code, and it'll show you exactly what's in your area. And you can bid right from home in your pajamas if you want, and then go pick the storage you know, uh, storage locker up if you want. So this is a really good site. I haven't showcased this yet. A lot of people don't know about this. Um, so it's a good site to use. Just type in your zip code and you can find some storage lockers in your area. All right, so let's go on to the next. This is the what more well-known one. This is called storagetreasures.com. I've done a few videos on this if you want to go to my YouTube and learn about it. Same concept. Put in your zip code and um, you can see exactly what's going on in your area. And um, again, even if you're not into storage locker, you know, storage lockers, it's very simple. You just bid. <clears throat> um, you can click on the unit you want. You can bid in your pajamas if you want. And um, remember, you can pick up individual units or you can pick up uh, business units you know, businesses that go out of, uh, out of business. And remember guys, this is a great opportunity to purchase a lot of inventory at once. Now there's going to be some trash and different things, obviously, but this is a good opportunity to pick up a lot of inventory, especially when time is limited during fourth quarter, you want to pick up a lot of inventory quick, right? So put in your zip code and you can do that. It's a very simple site. Never had any problems. And guys, uh, just so you know, if you, if, if I'm going too quick, just go to my Instagram um, so, so go to, um, Wade's Ventures Instagram here. And all you do is you click my link tree right here, guys. And it's right there. So you click my link tree and it'll, it'll have the list for you. Okay. All right. And the, the, the one before that uh, is bid 13. Oh, bid, bid, uh, bid 13.com was the other one. <clears throat> okay, so let's go to the next storage unit auction list. Okay. This is the best website to use if you have if you want to find auctions in your area. Now, just to, to clarify, the last two websites I went over, that's where you bid online. Okay. That's where you bid um, online from your computer. This is a site that you don't bid online, you find live auctions in your area. So you can sign up for this. You get a seven-day free trial, and then I re I recommend just canceling after that. And by the way, guys, the last like five or six websites that I've been talking about are not affiliated, so I don't get paid on anything. Okay, just just so we're clear, the last few websites I don't get paid on anything, so including this one. But this is a website that you can use, and um, this is a cool website because um, you can find local storage auctions in your area. That are live so if you want to pick up a lot of inventory in your area use this site and it will tell you state by state um, you can click put in your zip code and it'll tell you exactly where they are live just download the seven day free trial and then cancel it after that once you get your information you needed <laughs> okay all right so this is uh, again if you want to find any live auctions in your area this is a good site all right, we'll quickly go through this, and then we got some really good ones down here, okay? All right, so Printful, guys, you guys know about this. Um, <clears throat> I, I've got another website that I recommend better than this, but this is cool. You can basically create designs, and then you can sell those designs and get a piece of it. 
um, just like almost like Amazon. So um, I'm not going to go over this too much, but Printful is a great website. You can use create designs. And then when people buy those designs, you get a piece of it, um, which is kind of cool. All right. So Amazon Influencer, I recommend everybody do this. <clears throat> um, it, so basically Amazon Influencer is a way that you can get a piece, a commission off of every product that somebody buys from you. So for example, um, I'm set up on Amazon Influencer. So what when you click my reselling supplies up here, this is Amazon Influencer, guys. So you get your own website per se and your own links and you can give out this. So those of you who um, don't have Linktree, get Linktree, sign up for Amazon Influencer. It doesn't cost you anything. And you just pick out any product you want off Amazon. It could be any product. And then when somebody buys it, you get a piece of the um, – you get a piece of the uh, the sale, and then they pay you out every month. Okay, so um, this is Amazon influencers, guys. Um, so that's what that is. So, but yes, all this stuff, most of the stuff, you guys should be signing up for because ninety nine point nine percent of it doesn't cost you anything. You should be signing up for it. Okay, just, a, just every little bit counts. So Amazon Influencer, that's what this is. So Merch by Amazon, guys, it's kind of like what we I just went over. Um, merch by Amazon, um, Reezy Resells. There's a lot of cool people that do Merch by Amazon that are way, way more smarter than I am. But Merch by Amazon, basically, guys, is you create your own designs, and then um, they will sell. And then when they sell, you get a piece of the sales, okay? Um, I recommend if you're a little bit artsy, definitely, definitely uh, sign up for this. And a cool thing too, guys, get this. I'll give you a couple tips real quick. One tip is um, if you're not good at, at this stuff, like go to local businesses, go to your local schools, because a lot of these guys don't um, uh, are not on this. And so you can get their design, put it on a T-shirt, and then when the schools need to get like more T-shirts for the staff, they can use your link and you get a piece of it. So you were just the middleman that took their logo and, and uploaded it. And then you give them the link. And then when they need to buy stuff, they use that link and you get a piece of it. Right. I don't know if that that's a very smart way. So schools, you know, if you've got like any kind of clubs, anything that's a business, let's say you go to a business, right? A taco stand, and you're like, Hey, let me give you, let me get your design. I'm affiliated with Amazon. You take that design with their permission, of course, you um, create a link for them, and then when they need a taco shirt, they'll use that link, and you get a piece of the you get a piece of the sale. So, very cool. All right, so now we're getting some good stuff, guys. Teespring. <clears throat> so this is really important. So Teespring is very very cool. Let me explain why this is cool. It's almost like um, what we just saw, where you create your own designs, but this is different. So Teespring is actually partnered up with YouTube, okay? So Teespring partnered up with YouTube. So let me show you, for example. So um, the cool thing is, is you can create, so Daryl, let's see. Um, let's see if I'm trying to think of, uh, give me two seconds, guys. I'll show you exactly. Um, Okay, here we go. I think Nick has them. Okay. All right, so let me show you guys. So, <clears throat> so let's say we click on one of his videos, right? All right, so you guys see this below here? This is Teespring right here, guys. So they partnered up with YouTube. And so when you have a YouTube channel, you can create your own designs. So I can have like a Wade's Ventures t-shirt. And uh, and then when people go to any of my videos, they can click it. They can click it, and they can purchase it. So you can upload a, a image, and you can create your own coffee mugs, t-shirts, women's t-shirts, different quality t-shirts. And when people want my merchandise with my logo on it, they can they can click that right below every single one of my YouTube videos, and then they can go ahead and pick up one of these items. Um, so you know. People that support me can, you know, pick up my logoed items through Teespring. And you can't do that with the other couple of websites. So if you've got YouTube channels, now there is a certain threshold. I think 
this is a beta testing situation. So it's not rolled out to all YouTube channels, including myself, but eventually it will. So that's the main thing too, is use Teespring now, get your website, or excuse me, get your designs up and running. So when you have your uh, YouTube channel, it gets a little bigger. You can just link it to every single one of your videos. Okay. All right. So this is another one. Mile IQ, guys, this is really important. If there's any couple apps and websites I've told you about thus far, this is one of the important ones. Okay, there's a couple of websites that you can use. This is one of them. Mile IQ tracks your miles when you're sourcing. Okay. It also does other stuff, but that is one of the things it does. So um, you want to get this. Is you can do Android and or Apple. So let's say you go to Ross or let's say you go to Goodwill. You need to be tracking your miles so that way you can use it for taxes, right? This is super easy and you can pick whether you want to go for business or if it's for personal and it can, it can tell you the difference, okay? So you see business and then personal right here. So you can track, um, you can track, you know, different, different things there. So you can do it on the desktop, you know, on your computer or you can do it from your phone. And um, you can put destinations in there or you can just click it and then it will track where you're going and then you can unclick it and it'll log it as miles. So, so mile IQ guys, use it for your taxes. It's gonna save you a ton, okay? So this is a really good website. Hopefully, hopefully you guys use this and, and uh, every little bit helps when it comes to taxes, okay? All right, so let's move on to the next. This is a really cool website. I don't think a lot of people know about it. <clears throat> it's called cartwheel okay very simple it's target so what you do basically is you download cartwheel android and or apple okay and you can get um basically barcodes like um discounts and then they scan it at the register okay from your phone it's that simple like you get offers right here a lot of people will buy these same products and they just won't even use this. So when you're out sourcing a Target, you get different offers on products and a lot of the, a lot of the home goods sells really good for fourth quarter. And so you download this app and then um, uh, pick which offer you want and then you just bring the barcode up to the cash register. They scan it and they give you the discounts. It's literally that simple. And if you use the Target um, debit card, you get 5% off throughout the year. So a lot of res a lot of a lot of um, a lot of people at the 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 cashiers will allow you to do both. Some won't, but majority of them will. So you can use this and your five percent off. Really cool cartwheel. If you guys shop at Target. All right, all right. Gift card granny. I added this because the bearded picker <clears throat> advised this website. Um, Ninety-nine point nine percent of the websites I've used except this one. But I've heard great things about this website. It like everybody should be doing a form of gift card buying um, as you know a way to save money. So let's say you're gonna go sourcing at Target, like purchase a gift card here. You save eight percent because you're gonna spend the money anyways. So purchase the gift card, you save eight percent, then you use um, cartwheel, and then you use your five percent. Look, like you you know, potentially could have saved 30%, 35% off of your purchase. So um, this is a good website to use guys. And you can, it has multiple different, um, you know, vendors basically, multiple different companies that you can do group on, you know, Google, Google play. I mean, this is another thing. Like if you're going to go spend a um, hundred bucks at JC pennies, why not spend a hundred bucks getting the gift card? That's 13% off. Right. So spend hundred bucks with the gift card that gives you 13% off. And then you've now saved 13%, right? So it's, it's one of those things you definitely need to do. <clears throat> Exclusive. You two are amazing guys. Go check them out on YouTube. I appreciate the love and the super chats. I love you guys too. You guys are amazing. All right. So gift card granny, this is another website guys. So remember every bit, counts like and if you want to get your your wife or special somebody some stuff at victoria's secret or if you want to source a victoria's secret like people people like literally i do sell bras from victoria's secret so purchase you know 19 percent off victoria's secret even if it's for yourself it's crazy 
All right, let's go on to the next website. All right, this is a really cool one, guys. You got? Are you guys ready? Let me know in chat if you're ready for this one because I've got something for you that nobody knows about. Are you guys ready? Anyways, I know there's a delay. So this is called Slick Deals, guys. This is a website that is crazy, crazy cool. All right? So you get a lot of cool stuff here. Like this is basically where companies go. Um, you know, like you can get all kinds of deals on products, but also deals on service too. Credit cards, like different things. This is cool. But get this. So this is the cool thing about it is Black Friday. So you go to slickdeals.com and you can get notified when these stores are going to come out with their famous um, you know, deals for Black Friday and they'll notify you and send it to you. Isn't that crazy? That's amazing. Um, so you can get Target, you know, like for example, let's say you want Best Buy, you can click notify me and then when they come out with their cool pamphlets, of awesome things for Black Friday, uh, this site will notify you. Now, not only does that, but you also get crazy cool deals on actual products. So it's a great site to use for that as well. But for Black Friday purposes, I would definitely do this, have them all notify you on all these different things. Um, so that way you can get some deals as well. And then, oh, by the way, you can click different stores. I forgot about this. So let's say we go to Kohl's. All right. And then, um, the best, I forgot the best part of this, but um, you click whatever stores you like shopping at and it, the coupon codes will pop up for you. So it's very easy to read. So you get 15% off kids and baby clothes and toys coupon. Like, like, and okay, so let's say you don't shop at Kohl's, but you shop at GameStop, right? A lot of people do that. Here we go. Coupons for GameStop, right? Pretty amazing, right? Uh, let's say we shop at, now uh, nobody shops at Macy's anymore. Let's say Best Buy. Boom, right here. Here is some Best Buy, 20% off small appliances. Like, and, and then, so what you do is you just get, let's say you want to get offer and it's slow. And then there you go. You can just use it on the products that these are the products that actually you can use that coupon on. Right? So what do you guys think of slick deals? Isn't that crazy? It's amazing. Um, let's go to another store. Let's say you go to Newegg. Everybody shops in Newegg, right, for computers. Here's all your coupons. Like, how easy is that? It's all right there. So, yeah, this is another good website to use. But if you want to go to Black Friday, just go up here at the top left-hand side. Click Black Friday, and it will have your, um, you know, notifying for the, uh, the cool stuff. Okay, so let's go to the next. This is a... Um, I did a video on Ross Dress for Less. Those, those of you who don't know, I, I purchased like 400 pairs of shoes from Ross, like within a month um, last November. And I did a discounts video. There's like six ways. Oh, was it five or six? I can't remember. Five or six ways that you can get discounts at Ross Dress for Less. So I don't put any of my videos on here. I don't self-promote other than that. Um, you know, that's the only video on here except my YouTube channel. So I put that there to help people with Ross, okay? All right. So let's go on to the next. We've got a cool – the last two ones are really cool too. So this is worth point, guys. Okay, so we all know when you look up comps on eBay, after a certain period of time, the comps go away, right? The the history goes away. Worth point's a great site to use because especially if you use vintage stuff, it's like a database of everything that's sold, Okay. And the cool thing about WorthPoint, it was a pull up the exact ad that it sold for on eBay. You can see the exact ad it sold for like a year later or a year ago, excuse me. So if you do stuff, if you're like, crap, I can't find, I can't find it. Like I can't find it. Um, go to WorthPoint. They have a free trial. So sign up for their free trial, look up the item and then cancel that bad boy. <laughs> okay. Uh, hopefully nobody from WorthPoint is watching, but yeah. WordPoint's a great site, guys. It's basically you can search items um, that has been sold, and so you can pull up the exact ads. I recommend it for every eBay seller. Um, you can pull the exact ad up that it actually sold for, and uh, that way you can get information on it on products. So, all right, 
All right, so Vintage Guild. This is crazy cool website. I don't know if you guys know about this. Uh, let me see if my thing will pop up here. Okay, cool. So Vintage Guild, guys. Basically, if you have really old or um, out of the ordinary clothing that you don't know much about, this is the site that you want to go on. It's completely free. And the the, the people on here actually know what they're talking about like they only accept people that are really knowledgeable and very old clothing and it gives you tags you can search anything you want on here um and it, it's just basically a resource guide for a bunch of different clothing and look see you can kind of see um all the different manufacturers here for example nike so for example if, let's say you're like crap i don't know what that nike tags for <clears throat> you can pull this up and it'll give you resources on kind of the tags, right? So when when primarily, I've got a lot of the blue tag 1980s, so it will kind of give you like ideas of when when it was um, released, guys. So this is a huge site to use for clothing, okay? So that's Nike's example, but let's say you go to, I don't know, some of these, I, like 99.9% .9 of these, I don't even know, but let's, okay, well, we got Apple here. So you go to Apple, it'll kind of give you a little little like dialogue here. Um, okay, this is not Apple, Apple. Um, this is something, this is a different one. But anyways, guys, so it gives you kind of information on the actual brand itself too. Uh, let's see, we'll go to one more. Um, man, I don't know many of these. Okay, I'll just do this one here. All right, so you see here, you can click here and you can kind of see the tags, right? Um, so isn't that crazy cool? So no more, no more when you purchase clothing and you have issues with tags, you can go to this site. It will give you information on the product and it'll give you tags. So you can be like, oh, this is a 1980s. So that's vintage, right? Oh my gosh. This, this site's amazing, guys. Give me some, give me some uh, love and chat if you guys have never seen this site before. Let me know. But a really good site if you need to look up clothing. Okay, let's go to the next. I won't spend too too long, but this is another good resource for clothing, guys. Um, also, other things too. It kind of gives you information about a lot of different things. So this is another uh, Vintage Life website that you can use. It's in my link tree. We won't go over it too much, but it kind of helps you um, with um, vintage style, different keywords. Um, this is a site that you can kind of use, and um, and uh, you know. That way you can get kind of like, and it has different pictures too of different genres. So anyways, um, and up here you can see 1920s, 1930s, 40s, 50s, right? So 1950s, 60s. So it's for older clothing, right? So it kind of gives you an idea for clothing. Another good website. All right. So let's go on to Reddit. Let's go on to Reddit. Um, okay. So yes. Now. I don't know. I don't know if a lot of you have, I'm sure a lot of you have heard this site, but I don't know if a lot of you have done this yet. Okay. So this is a good link to use for couponing. Now you guys are wondering, why are you doing couponing? Well, it kind of goes hand in hand to reselling because you can use these coupons to purchase inventory then to sell. Right. So um, this is a good site to use. It's basically, I give you the exact link you need. And this is kind of a cool site that will tell you up to date discounts on different things, right? So, for example, you always wonder how people run into these stores because a lot of these big box stores they don't put um, discounts on stuff until the last moment, and you wonder you wonder how people know about that. So, what people do is they will go to the store, they'll find that there's a discount, and then they'll put it on this site, and you can scroll through here and and holy crap, there's a big discount and go do it, right? And it's not just like, it's on random stuff too, like 50% off smoothie, kid size, organic bamboo straw. Like it's everything, right? Um, you got Amazon codes here. This is basically couponing like from actual people themselves. So it's not just couponing for like food and other products. It's, it's just like a combination of just, hey, here's deals, okay? So um, anyways, this is another good one to use. All right, so let's go on to this one. I had to give all credit to Craigslist Hunter. I just ran across this site. 
remember, <clears throat> I I'm creating this to uh to kind of bring like a bunch of different sites for people to to you know because a lot of people don't know about this like all the way up here okay so from here down from wave receipts down none of these are affiliates i don't get paid on any of these okay just so we're clear so this is all for people that are in the game that possibly don't know about these websites so from from basically here down um, they're non-affiliates okay all right, so this is a good website to use. Actually, it's amazing. Um, uh, Craigslist Hunter um, put this in one of his videos, so mad credit to you, my man. Um, this basically is electronic websites. So you can find electronics and their manufacturers from all over the world. Like, I can't explain how amazing this thing is, okay? So you go up here to brands, and it has every single brand of electronic that you can think of. Like every single brand of electronic you can think of. So if you have questions about any kind of vintage or non-vintage electronic, you can go here. So you click it, and it will tell you all the products within that. You can all, It will also give you the website, and it will also kind of give you information like Sony Corporation has taken over the support of this company basically, right? So it gives you information on the actual um, company, on the products. So you can kind of click it. And, and not only that, but it'll tell you what they're selling for in different countries. Okay. <clears throat> so you can see if they're actually selling. I mean, that's what's really cool about it. Right. So you can click on the product. Look, look, look at this. You can click on the product and you can see when it sold and how much it sold for. Isn't this cool? So this sold for $4, this remote. You can click it and it'll bring up the exact ad as well. Are you guys not entertained? Are you not entertained right now? Let me know in chat. Are you not entertained? So what you do here is, again, you click on whatever product you want. Let's we'll click on this just for simplicity. You can look up the actual accessory or if you got an actual like digital whatever, right? It could be anything. Let's say you find the exact model. You click on the exact model. And it will pull up the ad. It will pull up the ad if it's on eBay or e any other site. And it will tell you if it's US or European, but it doesn't matter because you can still copy the information from it, right? Are you not entertained? Okay, anyways, guys. So let's go to another, let's go to another, um, let's just do another one here. Okay, let's do Beats by Dre, okay? Everybody knows that. So you click Beats by Dre. Okay, let's say you have a Beats by Dre that you want to sell, right? Let's say you have Beats by Dre, Lady Gaga headphones, right? You click that. And it will bring up every single <laughs> – it will bring up the solds here. And even if they're, you know, from Europe, don't worry. Just click it because it will give you information, right? <clears throat> oh, this one won't because it's a uh, – I'm a uh, U.S.-based. But anyways, uh, let's see if we can find another one that's – uh, here in the US, I can pick up the ad here. Anyway, so you see all these? You can see pictures. Wow. That's crazy. Um, okay. Anyways. All right. So this one right here, guys. <clears throat> I don't know if this will pull up. Yeah, it will. Okay, cool. Let me take a, a sip of coffee here. All right. Yard sale treasure map. Android or iOS. I know a lot of you guys know about this. Just get it on your phone. Okay. Remember the old days where you had to like go to Quest? Was it Quest.com? I can't remember. I can't remember the actual website. But yeah, you go to Quest.com, I believe. You type in like 50 addresses and then you print it off on your printer and it will tell you exactly kind of where to go from your printer and your piece of paper. I mean, that was only like, I don't know how long ago that was. But yeah, this that this that that's what... This does, but only it's like website based. So download this and it will tell you, it'll pop up all, <laughs> it'll pop up all the garage sales and different things in your area. And the way that it does that, it has an algorithm that pulls it from um, all these websites like um, OfferUp, Craigslist. It, it pulls it all for you and tells you where they're located GPS wise. And you can set priority too, which is really cool about this site. So you can set you know, which way you want to start and where do you want to end as well. 
So it's a great site for you guys to use. Garage sale season is it's amazing. You got you got to have it, and it saves you time. Okay, so it's a really really cool site. And again, guys, if you need this, just go to my Instagram or below any of the YouTube videos, and you can click this, and it will uh, it will show you all these sites. So. One second, guys. Okay. <clears throat> All right. So I've got another five minutes. What did you guys think? Now, be honest. Was there websites that you have not heard about in the, today's presentation? Was there websites that you have not heard about? Let me know. Now, if you've heard about all of them, kudos. Like, seriously. Um, hopefully, this helped you. Uh, there's a lot of websites that you need to use. I think one thing, if I were to put it in perspective, one thing that a lot of resellers don't do is the small things to make them successful. So literally, download the Robinhood app. Use the link, use my link if you wanna support me or use somebody else's link to get that one free stock. And then have your whole family sign up for that. That's one way, like do these little things to make you money. Acorns is another thing, right? So do these things to, to, to make you some money, like do these small things, right? So um, it, don't worry, you don't need to have these, these websites wrote down. If you can't remember these websites, just go to the link tree. And remember, um, I can't remember the exact percentage, but most of these I do not get any commissions for. Uh, the top ones I do, the bottom, like whole half, I do not. So use, um, you know, if you need to go back to that, any of those websites, do that. But um, and you can rewatch this video if that helps you. Um, and anyway, so I'm gonna re <laughs> hopefully this helps you guys. I, I want this to help you for fourth quarter. Um, but yeah, get, get going on that stuff, especially the stuff that's, you know, that you can get going on now to help you. Like, I think acorns is really important to that site. So what it does is it takes, like if you buy something for 79 cents, it'll round it up to a dollar. It'll take that extra change and put it in a, um, um, put it in like a savings for you or invest it for you. You can take that money out anytime. Like, I don't know why people don't do that because you will never notice the difference really. And it will accumulate quickly. Okay. And, and, um, Robin hood. Yes. They'll ask you for your social, but it's, it's, um, they do that to tax you if you make over like thousands and thousands of dollars. So don't feel weirded out about that, but it will give you a free share tonight that you can sell and put in your bank tomorrow, Robin did. So that sort of stuff, it takes like two seconds. It will save you money. And then all the other websites as well. So <laughs> anyways, yeah, so Robin Hood, um, let me show you real quick. Uh, let me see if I've got it on this phone. Let's see. Okay, here we go. I'll show you, Jess. It's like really simple. So you download Rob. Oh my gosh, the screen is dirty. Woo -hoo -hoo. Sorry, guys. Um, download Robin Hood. Download Robin Hood. It will ask you for your name, your address, all that, because it is a broker. It's like E-Trade. Um, but make sure you use somebody's link. And I'm not telling you that because it helps us, but I signed up for Robinhood and I didn't use anybody's link and I did not get a free share of stock. So you have to, you have to sign up with a link to get a free share of stock. Um, so sign up with somebody's link, put in your information. It will literally give you a free stock. Now they rate it. So you have a chance of getting Apple or GM or uh, General Motors. There's a lot of them that you can get. It'll give you a random share. I've got like five shares of Sprint. Um, and literally that share of stock is yours. They put that share into your account. And the way they do that is Robinhood pays for that share. Um, so they'll, they'll pay for that share for you. They'll put it in your account, no strings attached. You then can sell that share of stock tomorrow if you wanted and put it in your bank account. But I would recommend keeping it and then giving your link after you signed up with somebody else's link to your friends and family. So that way you get a share and then they get a share every time you share it. So large amount of nuggets. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, so, all right, guys. Um, I 
I appreciate everybody coming tonight. I'm going to make this short and sweet. We've already been on here for an hour. I love every one of you guys. Hopefully you have an awesome day. Um, and we got we got our norm, normal a cadence soon. We've got some really great resellers that you guys talk to on a day-to-day -day basis that are going to be live next week. And one of them is a very amazing reseller. I don't know if I can tell this yet, but um, I think Hickory is going to be on live next week with us on the channel. So anyways, there's a lot of cool stuff. Um, so look forward to that next week. It's going to be jam packed with about four interviews. And so if you guys have any questions, reach out to me on Instagram. That's the best way to get a hold of me. And so again, hopefully you guys got something out of this video. Have an awesome night and go crush 2018 member guys. Isn't this crazy? We have two months, two and a half months, and then we have six months, and then we have eBay open. All right, guys. Have an awesome night, all right? See ya.